This is Achievement Idol Inferno B2, a map for TF2 by Icy Eyes. This map is a parody of Achievement Idol by S Brown. S Brown? S Brown? Oh well. An infamous map made during the height of the hat craze in TF2. I might as well talk about it now a bit since it's a pretty weird map itself. And I won't get a chance to otherwise. The early version of the drop system was random, and would drop items as long as you were in game. Some players exploited this by joining a server and leaving the game running as long as possible. Achievement Idol was made to capitalize on this need for a map, where no one did anything and it became insanely popular. It's made up of two spawn rooms with open windows looking into each other's spawn. Staying in the spawn will slowly kill you via a trigger hurt. You can avoid this by standing on the window ledge, hallway, or capture point. The point cannot be captured. There's been a lot of edits of Achievement Idol over the years, but Achievement Inferno stands out to me for its sense of humour. It's like a shit post with effort put in. I appreciate that. The blue team spawns on a ramp that slowly takes them towards a pit of fire. Once the blue player falls into the pit, they fly up in the air in a spectacular fashion. Turning around brings us to a hallway similar to what you might see on a typical idol map. Just like in the original idol, around the corner is a point that cannot be captured. As expected, the entrance to red spawn is blocked off. No visualizer, however. The red team spawn is in a very hot shower. Hot to the point it hurts. Not as exciting as blues, but it's the Ford that counts. Just like with blues, there's a path leading to the middle point. Unfortunately, I could not get into touch with Icy Eyes. The website and email mentioned on Game Banana, and then the readme file included with the map, both seem to be dead. They still seem semi active online still but I wouldn't know how to get into contact with them. I imagine I've changed their Steam name as well, because I can't find them on there either. Icy Eyes has also made this very interesting achievement map called Achievement Construct B1. I quite like the dispenser conveyor belt. It appears this map was last updated around the Scout update, since all the other boxes in this room with update weapons are empty. Taking the teleporter from the blue spawn brings you to a conga line of red players to camp in a void, with some other things to help with achievements. I believe the idea behind this map was to have a secure area for blue to start out in, and for red players to have a less secure area. Based on their game banana profile, they also made their own version of CP Orange called CP Spire. It was made with a focus on vertical combat, and honestly, it looks rather nice in my opinion. It has a Maya Aztec theming going on, that fits quite well with its verticality. Later, Icy Eyes made CP Sacred, an expansion on the vertical focus of Spire, with quick intense matches kept in mind. So that's Idle Inferno. I would imagine back in the day that joining a server running this map would have been a very welcome change from all the other Idle maps. There's a certain morbid joy in watching ragdolls and video games fly up in the air. Look at them go. Woo!